What is up guys, it is Ugly Strew here, and welcome back to my let's play of Doom Tomb's Ancient Aliens. We are moving on to map 23, the Trinary Temple. Um, I've actually got some great news for people who have been watching my videos for at least the last uh, eight months or so. Uh, back in February, I was charged with a crime I did not commit, and all of my electronics were seized by the US government because they thought I was a terrorist or something, um, because my memes were too edgy for them. Uh, so aside from getting kicked out of school, my girlfriend breaking up with me, and my entire life spiraling downwards, um, I've been dealing with super shitty hardware in my temporary computer, and it's been causing me a lot of technical difficulties when I'm recording. Um, this is just because I couldn't really afford to upgrade it, and the feds had my more serious rig that had a lot more expensive hardware in it. Worst part about it was that I wasn't able to play the new Doom game, which I pre-ordered and was really, really hyped about. Well, anyway, it'll finally be settled within the next few weeks, confirmed. And I'll most likely have all of my things before I move away. That's as long as I just don't go kill somebody or smoke crack or anything like that. So, um, not really important to my YouTube channel, and I don't expect you guys to give a fuck at all, but yeah, I'm super excited, and that means I might actually be able to come up with some better content in the near future. Uh, anyway, Trinary Temple, uh, this is a huge map, I'm just going to this autosave so that way it'll load quicker. Um, it's huge. I actually think it's coming close to capping the size limitations on the Doom engine, so um, a lot of people actually think this map's a real doozy because of it, um, but I actually enjoy it a lot, despite it being obnoxiously large and having a ton of snipers, um, and unnecessarily large hordes of bullshit. Um, it's just got a really good soundtrack, and it's just an absolute masterpiece to the eyes, so um, I just apologize in advance if this is a long... Actually, it's not even really going to be a long video. I'm going to split this up into two parts, because the map is just that fucking big. And it makes me wonder why I didn't split up longer maps that I had trouble with like this in the past, like map 30 of Scythe. That would have been a great map to split up into two, three parts. I would have just had a much better time with it. But anyway, uh, we'll grab our chain gun. Fire at those barrels, kill the two shotgunners. And this is a neat little water effect that they have. If you stand in it, you will just start to flow down the river. But it doesn't do it on standing ground. I don't know how you script that. I'm not the person to ask. I'm not a doomer. Or a doom mapper. But yeah. So anyway. Come down and enter the shit show. Fuck. Okay. Well, that was off to a fantastic start. I just got like a really bad stomach cramp. Like, as soon as I dropped down, it was just I knew I was in for trouble. <laughs> So, you really want to be moving around all the time because of the Lost Souls here. And also because of the hitscan enemies. We'll have a chain gunner up there who's probably the first priority. It's also hard with this lag that I'm getting. This lag is also like inevitable. I feel like anyone who plays this map with any hardware is going to experience this sort of frame rate lag that I'm experiencing. Now, I don't have the best computer. I'm actually thinking about selling this computer, and obviously it's usable. I'm probably going to sell it afterwards. I've been gaming on it for six months, and I've actually loved it. The only... I've just been having trouble playing AAA games. So... But, like, indie games and stuff, I've been playing a ton of Path of Exile lately, and it's been running fantastic, so... We'll, uh, continue on down here. I'm just going to pick up all of the little ammo bonuses that are around here. Luckily, we're given a backpack, so ammo's not really that big of a problem in this map. I also don't remember who designed this map. It's probably a skill saw map. I could be wrong, though. Because I think I remember saying, oh, I don't remember playing any of this person's maps. Alright, so specters will be behind us, as well as his skin enemies. And we'll be getting shot at by everything else, and it's causing me to lag tremendously. Let's come up here. There's more ammo around here. Yeah, I can grab that. But yeah, as you're sort of making your way up here, you just kind of got to be careful because there's just fireballs flying at you from everywhere. <clears throat> so anyway, we'll come around here. When you start to come in, uh, Cacodemons will teleport in. There's a lot of cacodemons at this part. But good news is we don't really have to kill them because they're not that much of a nuisance. Well, we don't have to kill them just yet. We eventually will, but... 
my rule of thumb for this is just kill them when you get close to them. Like, don't go crazy and, like, chase them down like that and don't really try to snipe them. Because you do want to save your ammo as much as possible. But, like, here I have clear shots on them, so I'm gonna shoot them. Uh, when you jump down, there will be a lot of imps and uh, two Hell Knights. I think just two of them. Yeah, two Hell Knights for now. That'll teleport in. We can hit that switch. And now we just have to start killing everything with what ammo I have. Actually, main priority is probably to come down here and get the Revenant, because he can snipe you. But also try not to die by anything else. Um, I'm wondering if I should just go for the rocket launcher, which would probably make this a little bit easier, but at the same time, I kind of want to save my rockets. If you want, you can hit the switch, and this will also take you either to the other side here, or to the top. It's mainly just like, I just gotta run around. Mmm, fuck. Yeah, we also have a Baron over here guarding the rocket launcher. Probably just gonna take this route. I feel like it's a bit safer. These, uh, Spideys are the main problem. There we go, Clat. Followed by Hell Knights. Alright, I just ran through that, uh, my Cacodemon, but okay. Alright, so I think that's pretty much everything for now that we're gonna deal with. However, we will jump down here and kill this asshole. Yeah, this is going to be a long video, or series of videos. I'm probably just going to split it up into two parts. I think two parts seem sufficient. You can pick up the rocket launcher, jump up, and this part's tough. I like to come over here first. Ah, I got pushed down, motherfucker. If you get pushed down, it really sucks. Oh, no! Because if you get pushed down, there's chain gunners down there that I don't necessarily want to deal with right now. Oh, no! I keep falling! Okay, there's one down. There's two down. Awesome, there's three. Okay. So now what we're gonna do is go for the chain gunners. I think there's three of them total. But then, yeah, we have a bunch more imps to deal with, which aren't really as threatening, but they're kind of just annoying. I can see why people dislike this map, just because there is a lot of snipers, which I've said on numerous occasions that I do not like. Um, and I don't know, maybe the map just isn't visually appealing to a lot of people. But imps don't seem to bother me when they're snipers. It's mainly just the hitscan enemies, which there's not actually too, too many of. So before we continue on, I just, I want to continue picking up these little bonuses, because I'm definitely going to need them. Oh, for some reason I thought that would bring me up. Okay. I'm looking okay on armor. I'm going to keep this, because I do have a green armor that I can grab. Not down there, down there. But I'm not going to grab that just yet, because I'm looking okay. Instead, I'm just going to... Continue on down here. When you try to come in here, there will be spiders. And lots of imps. <clears throat> and this is going to cause my game to lag a lot. I'm kind of not looking forward to this. Uh, this was bad. I probably shouldn't have done that because it's going to be really tough for me to get back up now. Yeah, this is actually the only pain in the ass. I lied, it's not the only pain in the ass part of this map. But this part is, uh, this is kind of annoying. It's not the worst thing in the world, but... This is probably the reason why people don't like this map. I'm running pretty low on ammo, and I don't exactly remember where more is. Well, I do, but I can't exactly get to it just yet. <laughs> so I gotta hope my, uh, my chin gun will suffice for now. 
think they all came out from here. Yes, we are safe. If you need to, for whatever reason, you could come in here. Um, but upon doing so, <laughs> more cacodemons will show up. There's one example that I actually want to sh spend a little time talking about in this whoa in this map is good monster placement. And I actually like this a lot. Now if you come into here, you're given a couple shells, but you are also given a few shotgunners. The reason why I like that so much is because this is a part where a lot of people run out of shotgun ammo, including myself. So not only does it give you more shells, but, you know, if the developer may seem like that's too easy, instead they'll throw you some enemies that drop shotgun shells. Which I think is really, really good. So, I think that is an awesome, uh, awesome monster placement there. I'm not going to kill that pinky in the cage yet, because there's bigger fish to fry. Yeah, we have that mancubus up there, but I'm not going to go for him just yet, because he's not really too threatening. Ooh, that hurt. Actually looking okay right now. It's gonna get much worse though. <laughs> Alright, so we're gonna pop up here. And this will be like oh if you need a super shotgun, I don't know why you're giving another one there, but <clears throat> Alright, um excuse me. Um we we'll wanna come up here. Upon doing so it's another fucking horde. I don't remember if there's any on this level. I don't have a lot of practice in this map. I've only ran this outside part like twice. Oh, the gackos. I just want them to like sort of come my way a little bit. Kako, won't you come my way? Alright, so if we do shoot the pinky in the cage, specters will actually start to uh, to teleport in as the cage lowers. I actually like that effect as well. See, this map's just got like a lot of cool shit in it that you don't really see in a lot of other Doom maps. Wow, we're actually doing really, really well. I almost feel like this is too easy. I almost feel like I'm forgetting something. As I said, I don't have a lot of practice here, but I mean, we'll just continue on, I suppose. Oh, what am I doing? The stairs aren't this way, silly me. I want to just burst fire at these uh, little zombie men up here. As well as the uh, imps hiding in the trees. Sounds like a fucking deathcore band or something. <laughs> a midget deathcore band. <laughs> oh, speaking of deathcore. Dude, I went and saw... Uh, I don't know if any of you guys are like metalheads or like metal fans or anything. But I went and saw August Burns Red live last week and it was fucking insane. August Burns Red era... Silent Planet and make them suffer, and it was just an incredible show. Era kind of sucked, which was really disappointing, because they're like one of my favorite bands, but... Um... This is kind of... I don't know how I want to do this. If you try to come out a little bit, Archvile will show up. He's kind of hard to dodge, and some, depending on where he starts to fire. <clears throat> but he's not too, too bad. Alright, so we have our yellow key. We need to go get our blue key, which is down there. Uh, I just don't know how I want to do this exactly. Because I don't remember... I don't remember what triggers that. Mm. Well, 
first we're gonna go get secret number one which is here this little sector that's a little bit lighter and come into here and this is actually the secret but you can actually follow this all the way down I don't even know why I came over here I like these trees though uh, <laughs> and there's a little spare <clears throat> but then yeah we have to do a bit of backtracking Ooh, I have 33 armor. Let's go grab the, uh, the green armor so that way I look somewhat full. Yeah, the map is just... This is a really, really pretty map. I personally like it. Everyone was kind of warning me beforehand. They were like, oh man, this next map's gonna suck. You're not gonna like it, all that kind of shit. I like it. Who knows, maybe that'll change when I get inside the temple. <laughs> oh man, okay. So we're gonna go grab our blue key now. Man, I just wish like my computer supported this a little bit more instead of dropping me down to like 30 to 25 FPS every once in a while. At least keep me at like a solid 30 FPS. I'll go console mode, I don't give a fuck. Yeah, upon coming down here, that's what it is. It brings in the Fucking chain gunners. Oh god, they're doing way too much damage. Whatever, I'll, I'll dance with them for a little bit. Alright, there we go. I thought there were more chain gunners. I guess I, I'm wrong. But, I mean, we got other shit we gotta kill right now. I will go for the Lost Souls and everything else, just because I don't remember if there's anything that teleports down here. I guess not, it's pretty clean down here. Baby, won't you? I got fucking Fetty Wop stuck in my head now. Fucking Cacodemons, I blame them. Ah, why did I take out that? Hello, Lost Soul! <laughs> that Lost Soul actually helped me out a lot there. He caused the Mancubus to flinch. That was interesting. Alright, um... I need to continue killing these fireball throwing motherfuckers. I need to kill them all a little bit more over here. Because this is also kind of tricky. Ooh, shit. And that's probably not a good place to kill him. And I'll show you why. You come in here. Yep. Archvile and a fucking spug. I never know who to go for first there. Jesus Christ, dude, that lost soul did more damage than fucking anything else. We can hit that switch and that'll lower these pillars where we can now grab our blue key. And continue on. I'm wondering if I should grab that green arm and ah fuck it, let's do it. Oh nothing else teleports in. I thought that was guarded as well. Oh, that's what I forgot to do. I forgot to go hit the switch. Fuck me. Yep, there's a blue switch I need to hit. Didn't have to backtrack because there is that lift that can take you back up here to hit it. That, I need the red key over there to enter the pillar, so... Or the, the pillar, the temple. Hit that. And now we can jump down. We can come in here. Alright. So, we will be trapped in here. In just a moment. This part I don't have a lot of practice on, so bear with me. I know shit teleports in at some point, but... Mm, Alright, well, fuck it. Come over here, there will be arch file. And spugs. Whew! Okay, and cacos. The red key isn't really... It's not a trap or anything. That's another thing I really like about this map, is there's no traps. I mean, there are, but, like, they're not ones that, hey, you grab a key and then die. <laughs> it's not Plutonia tier. Yeah, as you can see, that lowered. That's a secret that I accidentally accessed. Uh, we're gonna hold off and kill them. They're sort of... They're kind of just in the way. Ow. 
want that plasma rifle. I don't remember how to grab it. Uh, if we hit that switch, that'll actually lower these blue bars and we can get out of here. But I do want to go back and grab the, uh, the plasma. Oh, we also need to hit that. Yeah, I can go grab that now. Um, so yeah, next what we're gonna do is go get secret number two. If you shoot that switch all the way down there, <clears throat> you can ride this to the top and get secret number two. That revenant was just not dying. If you are having trouble with this map, you're given a uh, computer area map there. That'd be nice at the very, very start so you could figure out where all the goddamn secrets are. You just gotta spend a lot of time killing shit in this map. Which is kind of unfortunate because I want to explore a little bit more, but whatever. Let's jump down. And get out of here. <laughs> this is gonna be a nice little surprise. Because when you come around here... Oh my god, there is like 150, I don't know if that's the exact number, there's a fucking lot of these guys, these pistol guys, but I kind of like this because it makes you feel like you're accomplishing something by killing like a ton of shit, if you had like a good AoE attack, it'd be awesome here, but you know, we're not playing a fucking RPG, we're playing Doom, and it's the closest thing to an AoE in this game is a rocket launcher, or well, actually a BFG. I always forget that gun actually exists. At least in this wad, because we're never fucking given it. Alright, and that is it. So we have... I think everything is dead out here. And I grabbed the two secrets. So, what, we're at 20 minutes in? Holy shit, why? Why is it 20 minutes long? Yeah, we definitely, we're going to take a break now. We're going to pause this before we enter the temple, because we do have all three of our keys, we have two of our secrets, and we're going to go kill some more shit in the next video. So, take care, guys. I'll try to finish this video up. Actually, no, why not? Take care.